Oh no, I just dropped it in the sink, now it's wet. Oh. Well, hi guys, welcome to this week's video. Where have I been? I've been in Los Angeles. I was invited to go to the Chilling Adventures of Sabrina. Why am I crossing my arms? I never cross my arms. I was invited to go to the Chilling Adventures of Sabrina premiere in, in LA. So I flew out and it was pretty sick. And I've had this idea, so I've sort of, I vlogged it. And then, I'm so can you not tie it on this finger? I've had this idea because Sabrina's in high school and she's studying and exams are coming up, you guys are studying. I thought I would try and mix my vlogging and going to this premiere and giving you study tips because I think it's really important to mix education with fun and good delivery because I feel like you take it in more, right? So I'm going to give you five tips on how to study throughout this video so you got to watch the whole thing to get all five hidden tips. <laughs> it's like a game show. I'm not studying. Yeah, I'm taking my content to the next level. Laura's sitting there, by the way. Tip number one. Put all distractions away. Put your phone away, laptop, don't sit in front of the TV. No distractions. Anything, you know, that can distract you, put it away. I'm so bad at, like, sitting there, I'll be doing my thing. I'm like, yeah, I'm on a roll. My phone dings. And then I'll be on my phone scrolling through memes for, like, an hour. Excuse me. Anyway, the premiere was really cool. They had a red carpet. They had all the celebs. I saw the celebs. I was amongst the celebs. I was one of the celebs. Even I fangled over um, Sabrina's little cat was there. That was really cool. We got free popcorn when we got in the door. We had great seats to like the big screen. It was really cool. So I got all like dolled up for a little premiere. So I thought I'd show you a little bit of like me getting ready. This is really, why are there lines going through this? This is going to be a problem because that doesn't look good. How do I... Oh, I just made it worse. Did I do it? Why are there lines over there? Okay, I just got it. Can you see that I'm not wearing any pants? Oh my god, you can! I can't read. Mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna stop in the middle of that to give you tip number two. Is just do it. I remember one of my friends was like, Motivate me. What should I do? How, how should I study? Tell me, tell me something motivational. And I said, just do it. And you know what? She did it. Don't make excuses. As soon as you're making excuses, stop. Because that's dumb. Just do it. Can't be smelly in front of all the celebrities. What am I going to chuck on my face today? Always got to remember the primer. We're going to take your booty. That's a good amount. Did you see my boobs? Who am I without my red lippy? Ready to go. So the show was really, really cool. I was a little bit scared, but like, good scared. Who doesn't love a good scare? There was like this part where there was like this um, scarecrow kind of came alive and started chasing her and I was like, oh, run Sabrina. Oh, it was just really good. You guys, I can't wait for you guys to see it because it's really, 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 really good. And because I was invited to the premiere, obviously I have to wait for you guys to catch up. Um, but you'll get there, don't worry. My favorite part was sort of like Sabrina, obviously. But just her character, basically to sum this up, she's turning 16, um, and when she turns 16, on her birthday, she has to sign her name, you know, she has to sign herself away to the Dark Lord, and she has to go off to this witch school to become a full witch. But in doing that, she has to leave all of her friends behind and everything that she knows. And everyone's telling her to do this and do that, and this is what she should do, and this is what they want for her. And she's like, you know what, no, hold on, can we slow down for a sec? I want to go to this school, of course I want to be a full witch, it's cool, like that's what my parents wanted, but at the same time, I don't want to leave my friends behind. Can I decide what I want to do without all these other pressures coming from the outside? Which I thought was really cool because I feel like that's quite common where people do what other people want them to do just to please them and then end up kind of miserable at the end because they didn't do what they truly wanted to do. So I thought that was really, really cool. Tip number three is a study buddy. I think it's really important to have a study buddy because, or study buddies, it really helps me in the way that I'm really bad at motivating myself, but if I have people around me that are like also studying and we're all trying to motivate each other, so if they see me like slacking or not doing my work or getting distracted, they'll be like, hey, don't do that. But yeah, Sabrina's a really, really cool lady. Like, one of her friends gets super bullied and Sabrina kind of could get in trouble by trying to help 
her friend, but she doesn't care because she's like, I want to help my friend. So I thought that was really cool because that's sort of what friends should do. They should, like, you know, not obviously sacrifice themselves for a friend, but um, sometimes you got to put yourself on the line to help others, and I thought that was really, really cool. And she gets bullied herself, actually. There's these three witches from the school that she might be going to that are really nasty. To be honest, like, if there were three girls like that around me, I would be really scared and they'd leave my house. But she, they are standing around her, like, they curse her and she's, it was kind of scary. I was scared for her, but she, like, honestly doesn't even flinch. She just rolls her eyes, she leaves, carries on with her life, isn't bothered at all. Tip number four is water. Please drink water and eat healthy food. What you put into your body fuels your body, and then it'll work 100% if it's good stuff, but if it's bad stuff, it will only work, like, 65%. So I'm like, so for me, drinking lots of fluids, water, guys, water is really important, and broccoli. It's so like when you're studying, all you're going to eat is water and broccoli. That's it. Just had a massive bud. So the next day, Netflix had set up this, like, she got these stairs, and there were just a bunch of rooms that were inspired by the series. The first room was the high school. This is my favorite room, actually. I got scared in every room, but this room had a cool twist. So basically you walked in and they were like, we're going to film you walking down the hallway. Here's the video of me walking down the hallway. Basically they said, walk down the hallway and do your best like cool walk and then pose at the end and look really cool. What they didn't tell me was that the lockers were going to open and well basically give me the fright of my life. So that was really embarrassing. Everyone laughed and I looked like an idiot, but it made a good video, so it's okay. The next room, I signed my life away to the Dark Lord, because why not? You sold your soul to the devil, Jamie. Okay. Oh, this was the scariest room. I was only in here for a little bit. So you walk into this room, and around all the walls are these people in, like, red capes. And they're real people, and they were moving, and then they would be still, and then I'd be worried they were gonna move, and then... Yeah, I was really scared. Why am I so nervous? They're not gonna, like, come out. They're not gonna, like, come out. Is that a room? You said they wouldn't move. Oh, I didn't Thank you. I did, yeah, I was really scared. <laughs> and in the last room was this big table with these... I thought they were real people. The lady said they were mannequins, but I didn't believe her. I had trust issues at this point. Everything keep jumping at me. The final, final tip is tip number five. And it is, reward yourself. If I have, like, say, four hours of work to do, I can't sit down for four hours and focus and do my best. So if I separate it into, say, like, an hour at a time, and after each of those hours, if I do the amount of work that I've set myself for that hour, I'll reward myself at the end of that hour. So it's like, cool, an hour's not that long, and then I'm going to get to reward myself at the end. It's not so bad. And then you just do another hour, you roll yourself again. So yeah, those are my five study tips and my experience in Los Angeles watching the chilling adventures of Sabrina and going to the premiere with all the celebs. How's that for education and reasonable content? I think it was pretty good. Well, I hope you liked this week's video, guys. I will see you next time I make a video. Happy studying. Alex. Yeah. Do you want to do the clap with me? Okay. So Laura's going to do the clap. Ready? Three, two, one. Turns out the wrong side of the bed is the right side Get out of bed on the left and I smile wide Cause I know I'm gonna make this big It's the best of both worlds, I can change my wig Get it? Time to show what we each do Call stupid but we smile when we need to Screw logic, let's get crazy We is the new normal like the world is Jamie's You can't blame me cause I can't be lame I'm just trying to have fun, keeping it on replay Be an idiot, rapping, act ruthless, screaming like Thanks to rap, baby, do it So the table's breaking in and was taking like it's another day but we can